Say you have a great idea for a book. How do you go from keeping it just an idea to converting it into a draft and eventually a book? Having written my second book, here are my thoughts on how you could convert your idea into a book and fulfill your desire to become a writer. We all tend to procrastinate. The longer you do, the more it holds you back. So it's important to have some place to put down your thoughts. It could be a diary or even a word file on your PC. No matter where you write, do it. There may be days when you don't feel like writing. Don't worry, some priorities take precedence over others. At the time of writing my second book, I was juggling multiple things. And I think that as long as you find time to write daily, you'll write. If not today, perhaps tomorrow. We all strive to write something truly original. It would make sense to check what's already out there that's similar to your idea. If there is something similar, don't fret. See if you can build on it with your own experience. As you continue to pen down thoughts and elaborate on them, you'll find patterns across ideas. Start labeling similar ideas and group them with sticky notes as these may become your chapters. Use a daily reminder on your habit tracking app or even a labeled alarm that would help you set aside a few minutes to write. Habit forming can be painful with work and home commitments, but if it's important to you, you'll do it. When you reread your work, you'll be surprised at how often a grammatical error or an incorrect phrase will stare back at you. You may also end up adding more content to a chapter or even change the entire direction of a passage. Once you've proofread your material several times, get a loving family member or even a friend who enjoys reading to proofread it for you. You may get great feedback to make it better. So remember not to feel let down by any corrections or errors being pointed out. The uniqueness of your book will depend on how you put a personal spin to it. Connect events in your life to make it a personable read. Perhaps do your own research as well. Before you get your book out to the public, get it reviewed by a group of peers who are willing to take the time out to read your work. I think that this is an important step in finally getting a piece of work ready for publishing. The more upfront this group is, the better. At times, getting stressed out is the easiest thing to do. A book writing journey can be intimidating, stressful, or even joyous. While writing, you need to pace yourself and allow time for incubation to take effect. There really is no point if it's not fun. Your book will get a lot more perspective the more life experience you have. So spend time with people you love, do things that give you a sense of fulfillment and remember to have fun with it. I hope these pointers help you write a book that you are fulfilled with. And in my next video, I will talk about how you can get your written draft published as an ebook or in print. Take care and keep writing.